Welcome back everybody. Today we're here to talk about The Walking Dead Season 10 Episode 21 titled Diverge. This episode takes us back to Carol and Daryl and we're going to be seeing the aftermath of Episode 18. Um, now this episode, or excuse me, this trailer, um, we're going to be going through it and breaking it down shot by shot. The trailer is a trailer which has commentary from the cast. These are like a new type of trailers they've been releasing right after the episode. Uh, but then there's another trailer that usually comes out, uh, which is ma which is like a regular, you know, next week on the Walking Dead type trailer. So uh, I have a video on that as well. That's most likely going to be coming out in the morning, um, you know, tomorrow. But this trailer is also really great. We have some footage. Um, and honestly, I, I kind of prefer these trailers because we get some insight from the cast in their characters and I, and I really like these kind of trailers but yeah we have new footage uh, insight from the cast uh, so we're gonna be breaking all of that down in this video today obviously general spoiler warning in case you are not caught up with the show and then also if you're a fan of the walking dead be sure to hit the subscribe button because we have a lot of walking dead content coming out throughout the week um, and since we're back in the walking dead season just like in general so be sure to subscribe if you're a fan but yeah let's get into the video so as always we're gonna go ahead and read the synopsis like we always do right before uh, the trailer so it says diverged um episode 21 like i said and the synopsis says at the lowest point in their friendship, Daryl and Carol come to a fork in the road and head their separate ways. Carol returns to Alexandria while Daryl stays on the road, each going into their own separate type of survival mode. So yeah, I'm really interested in this one. Episode 18 was really rough on Daryl and Carol's relationship. Um, you know, Daryl really lashed out at her. We didn't really see something like that before on the show. Um, so, you know, this, uh, like the synopsis says, the lowest point of their friendship. But even though it is the lowest point of their friendship, um, you know, I do think, which we, we will see in the trailer, like they've never really acted like this before. But even though that is the case, I'm sure they will get back, um, you know, to their normal friendship. I mean, they are getting a spinoff, so I can only assume that they'll eventually, you know, be okay with each other. But not only that, I still kind of see it as, um, you know, they still really care for each other and they love each other, but they're just angry in the moment and they don't want to speak. But I'm sure eventually, you know, they'll get back together. But yeah, um, you know, I don't think these two will be angry forever. But let's go ahead and talk about uh, the trailer itself. So it starts off with Carol and Daryl, obviously. They're walking, you know, again, they're in the woods, a continuation of episode 18. And they're having a conversation. Um and uh, Daryl's about to say something and Carol's like you don't have to apologize um so I think she was assuming that Daryl was gonna apologize and then Daryl was like I was just gonna say good luck so obviously referring to saying like good luck because they're going their separate ways um so I think maybe Carol is looking for an apology possibly and I'm sure Daryl will apologize in the future because again uh, and maybe even at the end of this episode, who knows? Maybe even at the end of this episode, Daryl returns to Alexandria and we get that apology. Um, but I think it'll eventually happen. We get this shot of them, like, literally going their separate ways. Um, which, obviously, is reflecting not only them going their separate ways um, in their adventure, but also, you know, kind of diverging as friends. But again, I'm sure they'll be back together. Um, one interesting thing is Dog is with Carol, which is really interesting. I don't know why. Maybe he chose um, Carol, uh, which would be, uh, you know, sad for Daryl, you know, because they've been best friends and, you know, he uh, found Dog. Or, I mean, he didn't find Dog. Dog was Leah's, but still, that was an interesting choice right there. We also get some commentary from Norman Reedus, which I'll go ahead and read. So he says, Carol, and obviously everything I'm saying is just paraphrasing. You know, I hear it and I type it. Uh, so it's not word for word, but it, I mean, it pretty much is word for word, but I might miss some things here and there. It's not just a direct quote is what I'm saying. But Norman Reedus basically says, Carol and Daryl are kind of at the point where they are fed up with each other. So they just go their separate ways and their friendship has come to a certain boiling point. So, yeah, that's what we pretty much see there. Um, and I think his way of saying that was really interesting, like certain boiling point, because that's what it kind of is. Like their relationship right now, they're fed up with each other. You know, it's boiling, but it's going to cool down eventually. Um, I think this is just a character thing. And we're going to have Cooper Andrews, who plays uh, Jerry. He talks about some character stuff later on in the um, trailer, which we'll get to. But these episodes are really focusing on character. 
Um, and it's part of relationships to have issues like this, right? Um, and we don't really, see, we never really saw it too much with Carol and Daryl throughout the years. So, you know, I think in a way it is, it does make sense for something like this to happen. Unless I'm totally missing it. But I don't really remember Carol and Daryl fighting too much. Like, I know there's been moments, like in season two, you know, when Daryl was frustrated looking for um, Sophia. I remember one time he got mad at uh, Carol. Um, so there's been moments, but for the most part, they've been best friends. So then we see uh, Carol going back to Alexandria, and we have Jerry here. So it's pretty cool to see Jerry in the episode. Um, you know, we haven't seen him too much in these extra six episodes, and Jerry's like, hey, dude, and Carol's like, hi, Jerry. Uh, so obviously, she's here to help out Jerry, um, you know, with the gardening and the rebuilding Alexandria and that kind of stuff. Uh, I mean, episode 17, we saw a lot of people there. So I'm wondering if this episode, how are they going to explain where everyone went? Because right now, it seems like it's just those two. You know, I mean, they probably just went scavenging. I mean, that's what makes most sense because remember, uh, Gabriel and Aaron were also scavenging. But anyways, we get some commentary from Cooper Andrews. And he says, when Carol comes back without Daryl, uh, Jerry knows that probably wasn't the plan. So the synopsis doesn't really tell us too much about what Daryl's going to be doing, which I find interesting. Um, is he just going to be searching for Rick? Is he just going to be going his own way? Because it says Carol returns to Alexandria. And in the trailer, we see her helping Jerry with the stuff in Alexandria. But Daryl just stays in the road. That's all it says. Daryl stays on the road. So, yeah, definitely interesting seeing what Daryl is going to be doing. Um, you know, and I like seeing Daryl out, you know, scavenging and, you know, doing his Daryl stuff. So, um, I don't know if he's going to be searching for Rick. That will be pretty cool. If he's going to run into some things, the Reapers maybe, we'll see. And then we have Carol and Jerry talking here. And Carol says, tell me how I can help. Um, obviously, you know, she wants to hop out here, but then we have Cooper Andrews, uh, with another voiceover and he actually says something really interesting to me. He says, um, these episodes really delve into a lot of characters in a way we haven't actually seen. It's not always fighting zombies and getting these badass kills. There's a lot of work in keeping these things running and we kind of see Jerry doing the labor stuff, working on garden, working on gardens and checking in on everyone. So the reason I found that interesting is because it, it essentially is like an explanation for these episodes. Like these episodes are delving into these characters in ways we haven't seen. And I bring this up because I ha I am seeing a lot of criticism for for these extra six episodes, people thinking they're boring or, you know, stuff like that. I mean, they're, they're definitely not the same as regular episodes. Um, but, I mean, I never really considered myself a professional reviewer. I'm just a guy who likes movies and TV shows. Um, and, I, and The Walking Dead is my favorite TV show. And I have some Walking Dead subscribers in the channel. So that's why I make a lot of Walking Dead videos. But for me, I'm loving these episodes because I'm just a Walking Dead fan. And these are bonus episodes. Like these are episodes that we're supposed to fill in the gap between because of the, the gap between season 10 and 11 because of COVID. Um, so because of that, you know, I wasn't I wasn't even expecting these episodes. I was expecting a delay in season 11, which we got. But then they fill in these they filled in the gap with these. So you have to remember because of the restrictions and everything like that, the episodes aren't really the same. Um, but you know, they're delving into the characters. Like just last episode, we learned a lot about princess so stuff like that, you know, I like, so I think we just have to keep that in mind when watching these episodes, you know, don't be expecting no regular season nine and 10 type episodes. But anyways, yeah. So, uh, we see some footage of Carol trying to help out Jerry and I'm not going to lie. Jerry is looking good in this shot for sure. Um, but yeah, I can definitely see some comedy in these, in this episode, you know, like it looks like Carol is struggling. Uh, Jerry's like a naturally funny character. So there's definitely gonna be some funny moments between these two, you know, picking up Alexandria, rebuilding. Um, and yeah, I mean, that's, that's what I mean. Like we most likely wouldn't see this in a regular episode, like rebuilding Alexandria. It would just be rebuilt. But they just have to fill in the gaps, and that's what they're doing. Uh, and then Cooper Andrews goes on to talk about, you know, his wardrobe and, you know, stuff like that. But, yeah, we see a lot of Carol and Jerry in the trailer. Not too much of Daryl. So uh, what do you guys think he's up to in this episode? Do you think he's just walking around thinking about things? Do you think he's looking for Leah? Do you think he's possibly looking for Rick? Uh, is he going to run into the Whisper? I mean, not the Whispers. Uh, that would be quite a twist. Is he going to run into the Reapers? You guys let me know in the comments down below. What do you think? But 
Yeah, I, I am very interested in this episode, um, you know, especially for the Daryl stuff. And then also I want to see uh, what's going to happen to the relationship between Carol and Daryl. But yeah, that, that was a trailer we got. So you guys let me know your thoughts and opinions in the comments down below. Uh, the more regular trailer we usually get, like the next week on The Walking Dead, I'll be having a video on that also uh, tomorrow morning, so be sure to stay tuned um, and stay tuned for the rest of The Walking Dead videos by hitting that subscribe button. But again, I'm going to wrap it up there, so you guys let me know your thoughts and opinions in the comments down below. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like rating, and as always, thanks for watching, please take care, and I'll see you guys soon.